Hello again. So we have done, I uh, right here, um, we have done the inner voices and the outer voices. And what we're going to do next with We Thank Thee, O God, for a Prophet, I think that a lot of you are probably going to think is easier. Uh, we are simply going to read the left hand and the right hand. Uh, so you would do this in a choir if you were uh, you wanted to rehearse just the sopranos and the altos, obviously. Um, and then in a little bit, we will also be doing just the tenor and bass and then finally putting all together. And hopefully by the end of this course, you'll be able to play one hymn and kind of know uh, the steps that it takes um, to be able to play and rehearse a hymn. So right now we're going to do just the right hand. Um, I'll just do it slowly a couple times. Um, and hopefully you're following along and getting it. Uh, if you're not, please let me know. So we start here on middle D. Okay, good. Um, so just to talk about a couple things, the first two notes there, you play the D first, and then you play the E, and you'll notice that there is a tie to the next D that is still held. Uh, make sure that you do that every time that you see that. That would be important so that the altos know to still hold their note if you're running parts with them. Okay, um, and then it happens again. I'm just going to do it slowly one more time, um, and that will be good. So we'll do right hand. Here we go. <laughs> I messed up. Let's do that again. Okay, good. Now, just a little quick note on fingering. I'm starting with my thumb here, and then when that goes higher, I kind of switch positions to, to moving my thumb up to the F sharp and moving it up. Uh, and that is the way that I would do it um, and play it live. Okay, hopefully um, that makes sense. Good luck. Uh, happy practicing.